Hello guys, today I'm going to be playing The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. Yes, let's just jump straight into it. Open. Wake up, Link. I'm awake. That's the best. That's the best Link impression that I can do besides screaming. I can do a pretty good Link scream. Tut. I think that was pretty good. Tut. Yeah, that was much better. Hello, naked Link. Put some freaking clothes on, man. I mean, you've been laying in the water naked for a while. How are you not freezing? Your toes will suffer. Well. Got my Zelda Breath of the Wild controller. There's the pedestal. I've actually beaten the game before. <laughs> so this is going to be more of a commentary. Of me talking about how much I love this game and for what reasons. Whilst also having a fun... F coming into unexpected conundrums. Today we'll be covering the plateau. It should be easy. Your long slumber. A hundred years. Which isn't very long in terms of Hyrule, because apparently Impa survived. God, that dumb is old. How is she still alive? I don't know. I'm just a princess. I'm still alive. I'm a hundred years old. I'm like 130, 118, 129, I don't know. However old I was before the ancient calamity. There's not really too many unexpected conundrums to come into here. So... This is just gonna be a lot of me talking. And talking. And talking. Here we go. Open salami. Salami opening. Oh, that's right. I'm blind. Oh wow, how dramatic. I'm going, Zelda. <laughs> Calm down. Oh, if you couldn't tell, I am wearing clothes. I'm not wearing any pants, though. It's just a tad bright. Can I make it? Let me turn the brightness down, maybe? Oh yeah, there we go, that's much better. There you go, guys. Here comes the nice theme. Da, 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 <laughs> oh, my throat hurts. 
<clears throat> I hope you guys like my cover of The Legend of Zelda, Breath of the Wild theme. Good night! <laughs> just kidding. Let's just hope I don't get confused and go have the paraglider and then jump off the friggin' map. <laughs> I'm just like, whoopsie daisies, oopsie doopsies, I'm gonna fall off cliff. Just need to get all these Hylian shrooms. They're useful in a lot of recipes. That's the only reason why I want them. Actually, wait. I don't need this stick. Oh wow, I actually caught him while he's still walking to his- Look at that! I actually caught him while he's still walking. Wait, if I run- If I go fast? Darn it! I wanted to see if I could glitch the game somehow by doing that. No pants link. Look at the temple! Do you remember that? Yeah, it's from a game from 19. It's from the 90s. Don't you remember that? Why did I just say 19? That's not even... 1892. Yeah, it's a pretty old game. Goodbye. Oh my gosh, you're taking on my weapons. Don't mind me. I'm just getting all the good stuff. I know these things are supposed to not be used as weapons, but they really are. Besides wood, it's basically the only thing that these things do. They give you a high-end weapon at the start of the game. It's actually not it's actually not the best weapon. The best weapon that you can get at this moment, for some reason, is the enemy's weapon, the Boko Club. Besides, of course, the Traveler's Sword. So that's some fun trivia for somebody, for some reason, only starting Breath of the Wild in 2020. Or if you're restarting it, that's pretty cool. I'd like to restart it. I'd like to play Hyrule Warriors. You know, just to get the backstory. And I'd like to play the game again, even though I've already played it. But I guess I'm kind of playing it again now, aren't I? This time I'm not actually going to use the glitches. Because last time I like glitched myself into the Master Sword. Which was pretty fun, but I mean like, I don't want that. <sighs> Link. Link. Head for the point map down your Seeker's plat. See that plate that you're holding in your hand? You have to look at it. Do you see that little dot on it? Yeah, you don't really know where that is, do you? Well, you have to go to it. You may be wondering why I'm here. But if you know the secrets of the Temple of Time, then I think you know why I'm here. And no, it's not just for the ancient screws and springs and shafts and cores. No, you'll see in a moment, you new player. I'll take that. I actually have a weapon that's supposed to be a weapon. Yay. Gimme. Um, there's somewhere specific that I'm looking for. Also, I seem to... It seems to be that, like, whenever you're near somewhere that was, like in an old game, plays that little da -da -da, like melody over and over. Is that just me? Because like, whenever I'm near somewhere, like the Temple of Time, or that one ranch place from Ocarina of Time, I think, it plays like a little da -da -da song. Not like a song, but you know, it plays like those few notes. I just found that interesting. 
I don't actually know if it's possible to sneak strike these guys. I think they're just like, ha, oh, what's over here? It's taken me ten minutes? Wow. This is more of like, uh, how to do these shrines and stuff. Because I think a lot of people have actually already played the game. But have fun watching me lose my, lose my freaking mind whilst I play this game. Someday, I might actually play it with friends, so I hope you enjoy that conundrum shindig once we get to there. As you can see, I now have Hyrule trou Hylian Trousers. Yes, that's the reason I came over here. Might as well fight these a-holes. And get some foodsy woodsy. Bang. Oh, thanks for killing one of your buddies. <laughs> I'm laughing so maniacally over killing a book goblin. <laughs> Don't mind if I do. <sighs> oh boy. Gosh, this game's pretty. There's those guys. Um, yeah, I'm gonna get the arrows. I once found, like, a traveler's bow somewhere. I found some sort of bow. They saw me? Really? Ow. I'm gonna go get a shield real quick. Uh... I'll be back. I'll be back. Ooh. I'll be back. I like how enemies in this game drop what they're holding. So that just makes fighting the test of strength guardians that much better because you get like ancient battle axes and other really good weapons and I'm I don't even know how to play like <laughs> this is coming from a guy who hasn't even got like I couldn't even figure out the puzzles in Ocarina of Time and somehow I beat this game I mean, I did wa watch, like, 10,000 walkthroughs and kind of use Revalius Gale to my advantage. But, I mean, hey, it's an awesome power. You can't, you can't not love flying into the sky and being like, Ooh, I can cheese things now. <laughs> it's just so useful. I like how I'm wa talking about something that you're supposed to get, like, mid-game. <laughs> before I've even gotten access to one shrine. This is amazing. Oh yeah, if you didn't know already, spoilers. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. <laughs> Don't sue me. Oh boy. Oh boy. Cold area. Death Mountain. That place. That's us. <sighs> I'm just like, that's me. I'm on that tower, probably dead. I wish I could... I wish I... I wish I wish I wish... I could skip this cutscene and get myself some cherry Pepsi. <sighs> cherry Pepsi. Not sponsored. <laughs> I'm never gonna be sponsored. <laughs> Imagine when I get to playing Age of Calamity. I hope I'll have beaten this by now. Yeah, I'm gonna play Age of Calamity, one, once I get the game, because I'm a coward, and two, once I beat this on camera. 
Because if I wanted to, I could just play it now and be like, <laughs> I've played that game. Oh, there's that thing. Calamity Ganon. It's freaking weird looking. I hope you guys don't mind, but when it comes time to fight that thing, the horrifying monster beast, I'm going to look up a tutorial on how to get the Hylian shield. Because I tried it in my main playthrough, and I'm very confused. So, if you guys have any tips, please give them to me. Because uh, I don't want to stop an episode just so I can watch a five-minute YouTube video being like, Well, you go to the top of this thing, and then you open a chest that you should probably see from the start of the game, because it's just so obviously there. And then you're like, ha, I wonder what's in this. Mm -hmm. I don't want to watch something stupid like that. Being like, well, that was a waste of time. Uh, Dr. Jesus. Flying down from the heavens. It's just like, well, hey there, small child. Um, is there some way that I can get, like, <laughs> sorry for anybody who wants to read this text. It's going to be on YouTube and also Amino. So if you're watching this on Amino, I'm very sorry. <laughs> but <laughs> if you want to read this text, you can just go on YouTube and put it at the absolute slowest speed. Sure, my voice would be absolutely horrible. Or you could just be a normal person and play the game for your shelf. Shelf. Play the game, you shelf. <laughs> Hand it over. Give me the... <laughs> ravioli, give... Ravioli, ravioli, give me the paraglider rolling. That didn't even rhyme. Basically, I'm just trying to speedrun this place. Because I don't want to waste my time on the Great Plateau. Sure, it's it's beautiful, but I mean, like... Like, who likes it here? Sure, it's amazing for getting raw meat. It's... It was actually my go-to place for getting raw meat in my first playthrough. Yeah. For any speedrunners... Not even speedrunners, any first time players, or even fifth time players. I recommend using these woods over here, these woods over here, to get all your raw meat for your recipes. It's just very useful. I don't have a bow. <laughs> did I even, did I even fight those freaks over there? Those bokoblins? I didn't, did I? I'm gonna play back the footage to see if I'm just a big stupid dum dum and didn't pick up the boko bow. I bet, I bet you, the Hylia, I'm just being a big stupid gun dum dum. Today we're doing the Amon Ao Shrine. I thought we were gonna do more than this, but I'm running out of recording time. So here we go. Alright, here we are. <laughs> okay, Magnesis Trial. Oman Al Shrine. Sorry if this isn't <laughs> good to you. Like, seeing a guy who's already beat the game play this. But I mean, like... I just want to bless you guys with Breath of the Wild. <laughs> and I can't go back in time and tell him my past self, like, hey, you should do a YouTube series on this game. Oh, and also you beat Ganon, like, I don't want to do that. At one point, 
when I first got the game, I didn't know how to do this. <laughs> I did not know how to do this. <laughs> I could read. I can read. I just was like, screw this. I'll just figure it out by myself. <laughs> I was stuck for two years on that part. And this was my first guardian. That sounds kind of sad, but it was. Well, I mean, it's practically everybody's first guardian. Except the tryhards, who just go straight to the bomb trial. And they're just like, what? <laughs> this is a real pickle. Oh, look up there. Give me that treasure. I always forget this is here. I swear, I don't, I thought that I was dropping it behind the doors, and I was so scared. Travelers, but that's where I got it. I was like, huh? Oh, here it is. The end of the episode. You have proven to possess the resolve of a true hero. I am Oman Al, the creator of this shrine. I am a humble monk, blessed with the sight of Goddess Hylia and dedicated to helping those who seek to defeat Ganon. With your arrival, my duty is now fulfilled. In the name of the Goddess Hylia, Allow me to bestow upon you this gift. I'm saying it all wrong, sorry. Please accept this stupid thing that will go straight into your stomach and it will hurt. Ow! On that note, bye guys. <laughs> yeah!